Gemma Collins threatens to quit dancing on ice after Holly Willoughby's criticism leaves her in floods of tears. Gemma Collins has threatened to quit dancing on ice after being left devastated by Holly Willoughby's criticism of her behind-the-scenes behavior. The Toy Star, 37, was said to be in floods of tears after hearing show host Holly, 37, slam her backstage antics live on this morning on Monday. The TV personality, who styles herself as the GC, is now said to be threatening to quit dancing on ice after her headline-grabbing first week on the ITV1 celebrity skating competition. A source told The Sun, she's devastated by everything that's been said and is threatening to quit. She's feeling there's a conspiracy to bring down their biggest star. The insider added that Gemma left 15 minutes early during the live Dancing on Ice show on Sunday because she was exhausted after a day of skating and a 9 a.m. start. On the first show she told an exec she was the star so shouldn't have to be in group performances or stand on the balcony to watch the others, the source adds. The insider goes on to claim that producers know Gemma is a nightmare behind the scenes but they're willing to put up with her behavior because she is this series' biggest star. Representatives for Gemma and Dancing on Ice have been contacted by Mail Online for comment. On Monday DOI hosts Holly and Philip Schofield publicly slammed Gemma for her lack of professionalism, with Holly telling this morning, I absolutely love Gemma, 37, but there needs to be needs to be professionalism on a show like that. Kim Satane, 22, who is this morning's backstage reporter on the ITV talent show, claimed she left the live broadcast before the end because she was a bit bored. Dancing on Ice hosts Holly and Philip, who also helmed this morning, were left flabbergasted by her diva attitude and Holly insists she needs to have more pride in her work. Kim revealed why Gemma was missing in action, saying, We went into the live show, and then the last quarter of the show, she went home. Well I didn't know she went until after but then we saw this video and I was thinking, I don't know where Gemma is, and I went to her dressing room and she wasn't there. So I did speak to her after and she said she was a bit bored, but she does love skating. Holly then gave her opinion on the GC's no-show, saying, The thing is I really love Gemma, you know I'm a big fan of Gemma's and I think she's great on the show I do, but I think there has to be a bit of professionalism that comes into any work you do. Just a bit of pride in your work. Phil then scornfully added, In all the years I've been in television, I have never kept a studio waiting. Explaining Gemma's excuse for her behavior, Kim said, I think, she says it's not Gemma Collins, that's the GC. But Holly was in no mood to indulge Gemma's diva alter ego. The presenter said, But then that's absolute rubbish. That's just a really good excuse to get away with stuff you don't want to do. I love that side of her, I do love it. But I do think professionalism will always outweigh that diva behavior. A spokesperson for Gemma declined to comment to Mail Online. Holly's words come a day after it was reported that Gemma had infuriated her co-stars by turning up late to rehearsals for the week two routine. In a VT ahead of the performance, the group were left questioning where the reality star was as they gathered on the ring for training. One asked, is she sleeping? Before Gemma made her grand entrance onto the ice, completely unapologetic about her late arrival, she quipped, I'm the GC, remember? She later told the cameras, I was late but I showed up. I'm bringing out my inner diva for this number. Married neighbor star Mark Little, 59, who reportedly sent a series of suggestive WhatsApp messages to a busty model after she contacted him online, became the first star to be voted off the show this weekend. He said on Monday, at least I got the ice dancer gear on. I get my London bus pass this year, so I'm pretty proud of myself. Dance partner Brianne Delacourt said, it's hard but I'll still be involved. I'll be back on the show on Sunday. Mark concluded, I'll definitely continue my skating. Ice people are nice people.